Now, on the occasion of Albinism Day, the global community recognizes the challenges faced by individuals with this condition, including the impact of climate change. Experts highlight the heightened risks of skin cancer among albinos due to the effects of changing climate. Under the theme, Inclusion is Strength, albinos continue to confront various obstacles in today's society, with discrimination and limited job opportunities being prominent concerns. Our reporter, Nicholas Mbai, examines the main challenges faced by albinos in Kenya, with a particular focus on the impact of climate change. Climate change effects are pose significant problems for many people, but the consequences appear to be particularly dire for albinos who lack melanin in their skin, making them prone to skin cancer. Uh, when you look at uh, the biology of uh, albinism, uh, the lack of uh, melanin and pigmentation, that means that uh, the UV rays can easily penetrate the skin of a person with albinism. So that means that uh, our skins are more susceptible to, skin, to occurring skin cancer. Mr. Albert and Albino stresses the exorbitant cost of treating skin cancer, which renders individuals at risk unable to afford the necessary medical care. And when we look at uh, the expense of treating skin cancer, it is even more higher than prevention. So how better than educating people about climate change and alleviate the effects that would come with climate change? <laughs> In a Macheco sub-county, we meet Mr. Ndunda, a teacher who educates students with disabilities. Kwa hivyo kama ma, magonjo ya meongezeka, utakuta kwa mba wanaadhirika saidi kwa sababu mili yao wengi wao haina ule uwezo wa kupigana magonjwa. Kwa hivyo yale magonjwa ya takuja ya naesa waadhiri. Kwa hivyo yu ni njia moja ambayo upanzi wa miti. Kwa hivyo tunajua kwa mba uh, tukipanda miti ili tusuie climate change pia tunakabiliana na magonjwa ambayo ya naesa imbuka. As the world commemorates Albinism Day, the detrimental effects of climate change pose a substantial threat to individuals in similar situation. Nimekuja kusherekea pamoja na wenzangu maana mimi ndiye Climate Change Championship wa Kajiado katika organization inaitwa Black Albinism from Nairobi. Leo nimekuja kusherekea na wao maana tunasherekea siku ya wale mavu wa ngozi ambao ni persons with albinism ingawaje tumesherekea leo tarehe kumi mwezi wa sita badala ya tarehe kumi na tatu tumeona siku ya leo ndi inatufaa ili tuweze kushirikiana pamoja na wenzetu wengine wale wana ule mavu ili wajue pia tunafanana tunaweza kuwa pamoja kwamba we are capable we can do other things like other people pia tumefanya kazi ya kupanda miti tuonyeshe ya kwamba Atuwezi tufanya advocacy pale kwa kuongea, but tunafanya advocacy pia kwa matendo. Despite their struggle with the new challenges brought by climate change, many albinos still experience discrimination in their communities. Some are unable to secure employment opportunity, even though their rights are protected by the constitution. Jedida Mutinda, an albino herself, shares the experience of enduring discrimination for years, with many albinos even avoiding public places out of uh, kitu yenye ningaimiza watu wote wale mavu whether ni, ni ule mavu wa ngozi ama ule mavu mwingine wa wote jitokeze uonekane ujulikane pia ujue uko na uwezo ule mavu usikuzuie kufanya mambo ya kawaida you have your own strength uko na kenye unaweza fanya yenye itakuzuia ku, kufanya kwa sababu ya ule mavu wako na pia tuache kuficha watoto kwa nyumba tuache kuficha wale mavu kwa nyumba mtu akiwa kwa wilche akipatiwa kazi ya ofisi anaweza fanya mtu kama a person with albinism ako na ule mavu wa ngozi kama mimi ukinipatia kazi kwa ofisi yenye sitachomeka na jua naweza fanya mtu ako na ule mavu wa mguu yenye anatembea na crutches kuna vitu nyingi unaweza fanya pia tuko na michezo ya watu wenye ule mavu wanaweza fanya kwa hivyo tutoe watu kwa manyumba tuwapeleke shule tuwapeleke tuwapatie makazi sababu kila mle mavu pia kona familia mle mavu anategemewa na familia yake kwa hivyo akiwa kama afanyi kazi inakuwa ni changamoto pia kwake kuoa sababu akioa na ana ana any source of income inakuwa ni shida Laki 
Today, albinos participate in a tree planting event in Machakos County as part of the efforts to mitigate climate change. Zipora Ntunini, an advocate from Albinism Rights from Kajiaro County, emphasizes the need for improved employment opportunities at both county and national levels. Number to number, our county's government and national government, washirikene pamoja na sisi watunge mkono watushikilie ili tunapofanya hai haya mambo kuhusiana na hali ya anga waweze kushirikiana na sisi kwa kutu funds kwa funds ili tuweze kupata kama miti ili ya kuweza kupanda tuweze kufikia pia watoto wale wanaulemavu while many suffer in silence experts issue a warning that albinos in africa will soon experience the adverse effects of climate change just as it is already happening in developed countries where diseases like skin cancer are prevalent nicholas mbai reporting for tv 47 machakos county